Hello everybody, Secret Plot 45 here, and today we're going to talk about the Destiny new patch, um, 1.0.2.2. Um, looks pretty good, it's mainly weapon balancing issues in PvP. So uh, yeah, we're going to start out with the auto rifles, which is the most notable change, I think. Um, it has a base damage reduction of 2%, um, a precision damage or headshot bonus reduction of one, from 1 1.5 to 1.25, and a stability... Um, decrease from anywhere from 4% to 17%, so basically you're getting more recoil, and um, I'm pretty glad that they did this. Um, auto rifles seem like the obvious choice to me, right? I mean, like, you can use a pulse rifle, and you have to, like, regulate the burst and stuff like that, or scout rifle, you have to, like, tap really fast, but they just don't seem to do as much damage to me as auto rifles, so I was a big auto rifle user until I got my first legendary scout rifle. But um, speaking of that, actually, we have a lot of scout rifle buffs. Um, there's a base damage increase from... Uh, by 6%. Uh, there's a damage uh, versus combatants increase from 6% to 25% based on tier. Not exactly sure what that means. Um, improved target acquisition plus additional recoil tuning. So, obviously that is a nice uh, base damage buff, but other than that, I'm kind of confused as to what they mean by the the second one there, damage versus combatants. I don't know if that's like a PvE thing, like kind of a level bonus advantage type type deal. I don't know. Um, but improved target acquisition, I'm guessing that means we'll be able to see people from farther away, maybe additional aim assist, and recoil tuning is fairly self-explanatory. So, um, yeah, if you guys have any idea what that means, um, shed some light on it in the comments. And the other big change was the shotguns. Thank God, who got a decreased base damage at max range by 20%, a shot, uh, the shot package perk now has a slightly wider cone of fire, and rangefinder and shot package perks are mutually exclusive. So finally, we get a shotgun nerf. Um, I I admit it. I use shotguns because like they're just they're too good. Um, I, I feel bad using them, but at the same time, like uh, snipers just really I don't know they don't do it for me. And whenever I'm in like a tight tight close quarters engagement, I can just pull out my shotgun and just just wreck with it. And um, I'm really glad that they are nerfing them. Uh, my only real concern with them nerfing it is that people might switch to fusion rifles, and um. I don't know, I really hate getting one-shotted from fusion rifles. It seems seems a little bit ridiculous to me. Um, I'm going to go over what I think about that in an upcoming video of what I think Destiny should patch instead of what they are patching. But anyway, the last actual really like big change is to the Vex Myth class, which is the exotic drop from hard mode Atheon. So it's really hard to get. It's considered the rarest weapon in the game. And it gets a base damage um, reduction of 34%. Ooh. It's got to increase, um, ironically, from uh, a precision damage multiplier from 1.25 to 1.5. So, uh, yeah, they both kind of nerfed and yet buffed it at the same time. I've never actually seen anyone use one in PvP. I'm much more of a PvE guy myself, so I don't know how much it will affect like the actual gameplay. I guess you guys will have to see, but... Um, if you guys want to see all the other minor changes and stuff, you can check out the link over at Bungie.net. I've included the link in the description, so you guys can just go click on that. So what do you guys think of the patch? Do you think it's good? Do you think it's bad? What do you want to see nerfed and buffed? Um, I'm interested to hear what you guys think, so be sure to drop a like and a subscription for more Destiny content. I am Secret Plot 45 and I'll see you guys later. Peace!